Look at that. believe in God. Y'all a bunch of godless heathens. A bunch of pieces of shit. Everybody talking about I'm an agnostic. I'm an atheist. I don't believe in God. God don't exist. I believe in science. And y'all don't know shit about science. Ain't nothing scientific about your ass. Y'all a bunch of retarded goddamn jackasses. Keep going. For the faithful fall fail from among the children of men. Yeah, everybody talking about they believe in science. Have you ever met anybody that could break down some science to you? That could break down some equations and some algorithms? Very, I have very few people I've met could drop an algorithm on your ass. How many people you know can break down some algorithm? You know what I'm saying? Exactly. These motherfuckers that don't know shit, they talking about they believe in science, but they retarded as hell. They don't know what the word science means. You know what I'm saying? Keep going. They speak vanity, everyone with his neighbor. Hey, y'all, y'all speak vanity. You know what I'm saying? When they see us out here teaching the Bible, they'll be like, oh, y'all ain't shit. You know what I'm saying? Y'all ain't doing nothing. Y'all a bunch of raggedy motherfuckers. Out there wearing that bullshit. Y'all wearing rags, wearing potato sacks. You know what I'm saying? Looking retarded. Read that again, bro. It's all 12 and 2. Hey, you know, all these bitches, they want to talk shit about you. They see all oh, y'all wearing some bunch of rags. Y'all looking retarded. Y'all gotta get, get money. Read that. Psalms 12 and 2. They speak vanity, everyone with his neighbor. So all these hoes, all these dumbass hoes, they all speak vanity. Everything you talking about is retarded as hell. Okay, keep going. With flattering lips. With flattering lips. And with a double heart, do they speak? With a double heart. Y'all a bunch of serpents and snakes. Everybody is a bunch of goddamn liars. All these bitches is hoes, they all adultery. A bit, uh, all these women, they tell you, oh, baby, I love you, I never cheat on you. They, they fucking like, they fucking like seven guys behind your back, you know? Yeah, you bitches, you, you think you bitch, you got a, your bitch is loyal? She ain't loyal. There's no such thing as a loyal woman. There's no such thing as, I got a wife. And she loves me, and she cares about me. The bitch don't care about you. Go ahead. The Lord shall cut off all flattering lips and the tongue that speak of proud things. So all you fools that come against the word of the Most High, the Most High gonna cut your lips off. He gonna shut you the hell up. All these, all these adulterous ass hoes, they come up, they got a problem with the word of the Most High, he gonna cut your lips off. And hey, read that again. That's, a, that's in the Holy Bible. Read, that's a scripture in the Bible. Psalms 12 and 4. Who have I said? Psalms 12 and 3. The Lord shall cut off all flattering lips. I like Polite, your brother. You remember your boy, brother Polite? He be trying to be flattery. He be trying to flatter your ass. He come up and speak, use a bunch of big words and try to act like he all educated, but like, see the situation and the realization of the community and be the, we got it, you know what I'm saying? All that bullshit, all that, all that side talking. He talks like the serpent. That's how the serpent talk. Hey, read that again. Psalm 12 and three, the Lord shall cut off all flattering lips. The Lord gonna cut your lips off. Polite, you ain't gonna have no lips. Your speech gonna be brought to an end. You know what I'm saying? And all these other fools that come against the truth, your speech is gonna be brought to where you ain't gonna be speaking no more. The Lord gonna shut your ass up. He gonna cut your damn lip, he gonna cut your tongue out. You know what I'm saying, keep going. And the, 
and the tongue that speaketh proud things. You speaking proud things. When you come against the word of the Most High, you trying to say, oh, Jesus is just a parable. That's just a, that's just a myth. You know, you speaking proudly, man. You speaking like your ass just want to be destroyed. And you're going to be destroyed too. Hey, your boy Polite, he been got destroyed though. I just we just been laughing over your over this dude Polite, man. We made all kind of videos clowning on him, all kind of other brothers is clowning on him. It's just it's beautiful, man. You know what I'm saying? You, that dude Polite got fucked up. Yeah, anybody else to come against the word of the most high, they're gonna get fucked up. Yeah, yeah they've been dissecting. Yeah, their, their whole program got dissected by the most high. They got, yeah, they got a suplex. For real. For real. We, we, we did an autopsy on their bullshit. An autopsy was performed on that Egyptology bullshit. And this shit ain't hard to destroy, though. Because we found out the, the problem was they're full of shit. You know? The autopsy results came back, and they found out that the Egyptology shit, that's what it, that was the problem. They're full of shit. Right, right. They, they've been, they've been mummy, uh, mummified. Yeah, they got mummified. Y'all ass been, yeah. Right. Hey, that? check it out. Don't they call themselves um, um, Pan-African? Some of them, you know, they call African. themselves Pan-African. That means all African. I'm thinking about that name Pan. Pan, Pan, though. Pan means all, don't you it? You know, Pan. Don't that mean all? Well, that's a demon. Pan. Oh, that go back to pay. You're yeah, right. Pan, the demon. Oh, that, like that little goat demon. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. That go back with Esau. Esau's that hairy goat. The goat Esau Mount Seir. Seir means hairy. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, Esau's that goat. That go. You know what I'm saying? Alexander was a goddamn goat. Goat. A foul goat. Yeah, that nasty hairy goat. Where's Waldo looking motherfucker? Yeah, hey, Esau just be looking silly as hell, man. You just be wanting to slap motherfuckers, man. You see people walk by sometimes. Hey, I, I know I can't really punch people, but you really want to punch people in their face, man. Sometimes you just see a simple looking weak. Yeah, you, know, you just want to punch them, man. The stress holds you back. You gotta hold it back. Close to the stress. You see that nigga slide in front of the moving Yeah, that'd be real. You think he a ninja. Right. He gonna get fucked up on that little ass scooter. Mm -hmm. I'll go ahead. Psalms 12 and 4. Who has said with our tongue, will we prevail? Our lips are our own. Who is Lord over us? For the oppression of the poor, for the sight of the needy, now will I raise, arise, says the Lord. I will set him in safety from him that put him that Are you good? You good? Yeah, like, that looks like Simone's boyfriend from Pee Wee yeah. Herman. So the scripture's talking about the, who oppresses the poor? You know what I'm saying? In America. Here we got it. John 12 and 4. Who have said with our tongue will we prevail? Our lips are our own. Who is Lord over us? For the oppression of the poor, for the sign of the needy, now will I arise, saith the Lord. I will set him in safety from him that puffeth at him. The head that puffeth at him like a dragon. That great red dragon, that's Esau. You know what I'm saying? He's puffing at us. Uh, we we oppressed that it's talking about the oppression of the poor and the needy. Who's the poor and the needy? Is the nation of Israel, and we get fucked up out here. Should the fuck a? What the fuck they need to say? Hey yeah, and, and you ain't gonna and you ain't gonna see no other scriptures, so-called holy books. Talk, okay, the uh, the Egyptians they ain't have no scriptures like this. Everybody wants to talk about all oh, the Egyptians, all the troops was in Egypt. The Bible was based on Egypt. Man, uh, them Egyptian books ain't had no nothing like this, bro. They weren't uh, pleading for the cause of the poor and the oppressed. They were the oppressors. Bunch of damn heathens. Uh, go ahead. The words of the Lord 
or uh, hold on, like, like that dude Polite. I don't know why I'm talking about Polite, but Polite, you're gonna be destroyed, man. The Most High's gonna kill you, man. He gonna take your simple, he gonna explode your head. He gonna make your head explode like a goddamn watermelon. After he eat his kids. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you gonna eat your children too. You gonna, you just a demon, man. The Lord's just gonna kill you. He's gonna destroy you. He's gonna destroy your seed. He's gonna destroy all your wives. He's gonna kill them. It's gonna, be a, it's, gonna be a, it's gonna be a slaughter. It's gonna be a slaughter, a man. Great slaughter. The, the Most High is gonna fuck you up. Anybody else coming against the word of the Most High, the Most High is just gonna fuck you up, man. He's gonna kill you. He's gonna kill your whole family. You know what I'm saying? Burn your house down. And the Lord will cause a helicopter to crash into your ass and blow you up. Right. You ain't see that motherfucking open sky. Was that in Scotland? Up in Scotland, a helicopter crashes into a bar while they is having a concert. While everybody's having a good time, partying, drinking, getting high, listening to music. The, the thought of the Most High and the speech of the Most High went in nobody's mouth. But while everybody was partying, the Most High had a helicopter crash into, crash right into them and blow their ass up. Helicopter free, it was, it was a drunk point, you know. It mean? was a police helicopter. Yeah, it's like uh, that stage that fell on a oh, couple man. of few motherfuckers a couple of years back. Mm. So, yeah, it's, stage fell on. so that could happen to that dude Polite, man. Your ass could get blown up by a goddamn helicopter. You know what I'm saying? A fucking runaway bus will come through and run your ass over. Whatever happens, it's not gonna be pretty. It, it's gonna be ugly, man. Yeah, Hopefully, it get televised. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna right, be out. Yeah, <laughs> say he loved the camera. He liked to be on camera. Right, you gotta be all up in the camera. You know what I mean? You want to be popular. You know what I'm saying? You want to get all them hits on the internet. Oh, you gonna get some hits when your ass get hit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I get some real hits. Most high, he'll make a spectacle of your ass, man. You come against some more, he'll make a speckle spectacle of you. Everybody be laughing. It'll be a good time for everybody to laugh at you. Everybody to laugh and you be a Hey, get that. Hold on. Uh, get that. I'm going to get my Bible. Uh, get Psalms 2. Psalms 2 real quick. We get back to that Psalms 12. Hold the Psalms 12. We get Psalms 2 real quick. Psalms 2 and 1. Why do the heathen rage and the people imagine a vain thing? So, all you fools, you try to come against the word of the Most High, try to I debunk the Bible, the Bible's... Uh, mythology, the Bible's not true. Read that again. Psalms 2 and 1. Why do the heathen rage and the people imagine a vain thing? All these fools, they, uh, they, they think America gonna, gonna continue forever. You know what I'm saying? They think that everyday way of life is gonna go on forever. Ain't gonna be no wars. They never be affected. You know what I'm saying? Keep going. The kings of the earth set themselves and the rulers take counsel together against the Lord and against his anointed saying. Like the government. Like right now, you know it's illegal. If, you, if you're in the military, if you're part of the Marines or the Navy or the Army or any of that, it's illegal to teach the Bible. If you be trying to teach the gospel, like hit people with scriptures, they are court martial. Somebody already got in trouble for it. They actually coming against the Most High. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, uh, read that again, man. Psalms 2 and 2. The kings of the earth set themselves, and the rulers take counsel together against the Lord and against the anointed. And, and who's the anointed? That's, the, that's what the word Christian means, the anointed ones, the anointed. Because that goes back to Christ, and Christ means the anointed, because that's Greek for Messiah. You know what I'm saying? So the, all, the only people that was ever anointed was the nation of Israel. That's why in America, they try to do away with the, work, the nation of Israel. They don't want nobody to know about that word Israel. When you go up in these churches, none of these preachers are teaching their people that they're Israelites. You know what I'm saying? They want to do away with the word Israel. They want to tell you they're African American. You know what I'm saying? They want to tell you that you are Irishman. Or they, they give you all these bullshit titles that don't mean nothing. They try to push that word. They don't want. They don't want you to know about Israel. Keep going. Let us break their bands asunder and cast away their cords from us. That's because we we on slavery out here. That's why everybody in America is a number. That's why you got a social security number because you ain't shit but a number. 
I remember that Bob Seger song, you ain't nothing but a number. <laughs> Y'all you remember that song? No. Uh, you don't remember, cause he even said, you ain't nothing but a number, you ain't shit. Hey, to, to the government, you ain't shit, you ain't nothing but a number. Them so-called Jews to run everything, they call your ass Goyan. You know what I'm saying? They, they say that you ain't shit. They look at you like you, uh, what did they call you? Were they, they right? They really right, they really correct. They call you useless eaters. Cause all you, they call you consumers. Cause all your motherfuckers do is consume. You don't contribute nothing, all you do is consume. All you, you know what I'm saying? Cause man, really that's true. You're really right, most people are cancer. Most people really are cancer. They, all they do is just consume. They take, they don't give nothing, all they do is take. Oh, yeah, exactly. They had goddamn disease. I read that in here. Yeah, this is a spirit. Psalms 2 and 3. Let us break their bands asunder and cast away their cords from us. He that sitteth in the heavens shall live. The Lord shall have them in derision. So the Lord, so any of you fools that come against the word of the Most High, Most High, the Most High said he's going to laugh at you. Like your boy Polite, the Most High gonna laugh at your ass. We we laughing at you right now. You a big joke. You know what I'm saying? You big crusty the crown look, crusty the clown looking motherfucker. Like uh, you a joke, man. You a you a cartoon character. You know what I'm saying? We just laughing at you. You like itchy and scratchy or something. You, this motherfucker it's just. Yeah, yeah, I'm just trying. But I, well, I'm just saying, he's like a cartoon character. Yeah, yeah. He's a joke. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? He he's a goofy. fucking joke. He looked goofy. Look goofy, right? He looked like a goddamn cartoon character. You can't even take that motherfucker serious. If anybody, he got a, stupid look, on he got a dumb, stupid yeah. look about him. Yeah. You do got a stupid look. That's all them fools out there that come against the word of the Most High. Yeah, Polite. They look stupid too with them big ass afros. When they head should, should be covered. Yeah, hey, hey, your boy General Gahena, he looked like that dude off of Mickey Mouse, the bad guy, the big giant. Uh, uh, yeah, what's that uh, big? Brutus or something like that. What's that big bad guy? He looked like he all hairy and shit. He looked like one of the Brutus. beagle. He looked like one of the beagle boys. He looked like. Uh, 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 he looked like one. Uh, you remember the beagle boys on Ducktales? That's your boy General Gahena. He's just a big fat hairy. He looked like a big fat hairy swine. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> this is a big fat piece of shit. That's what he is, big fat piece of shit. Big fat faggot. Cause I was watching videos on YouTube, they had General Gahena send out representatives for their shit, they was battling with Polite. <laughs> and the dude just sounded like a straight up Uncle Tom, man. <laughs> All they cared about was helping out the community. <laughs> they didn't even care nothing about the scriptures and the truth. They dudes ain't got no truth, man. They was calling General Gahena father. They just, he kept they just calling his father. He's my daddy. He's my father. That big Sounds weirdo, like Jim man. Jones shit. Yeah, it's kind of like my daddy. Just like yeah, just like GMS came out with the Jim Jones special. You got yeah, you got watching people. Cause most of y'all people, y'all are part of a cult. People try to say we're in a cult. You know what I mean? Go ahead, read it. Psalm, Psalms 2 and 5. Then shall he speak unto them in his wrath and vex them in his sore displeasure. So the most all you the most high is gonna vex all you fools with his sore displeasure. Oh light, the most high vexing your ass right now through the prophets. The prophets are fucking you up, man. The elders done fucked you up. You know, and all the other brothers that came up under the elders all fucking you up, man. You getting fucked up. So it's, it's, nobody should be listening to Polite no more, man. Only a fool. Only a goddamn fool. Somebody high on PC fucking P, man. Somebody that's asleep. Somebody don't believe in the truth anyway. You, all you people th talking about we gotta go back to Africa? Why don't you go back to Africa? Hopefully you can get ate by a goddamn lion. Yeah, that's right. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. Hey, yeah, snatch your ass up and sell you on the slave market. It is funny though how they talk that the African bullshit, but ain't going nowhere near that nigga land, man. Hell no. Right. Ain't going nowhere near. We're going to visit. Right. Tell my hell no. It's going to be goddamn mosquitoes. 
set my king upon my holy hill of Zion. I will decree the decree the Lord have said unto me, thou art my son, this day have I begotten thee. Yeah, that's talking about Yahweh Shah. Now let's get back to the, uh, Psalms 12. Let's get back to that real quick. I just want to get that point right there because the Most High, because that's what it's talking about, the Most High is going to laugh at all you fools that's just coming against the truth, man. The Most High is going to laugh at you. We're going to laugh at you. When the Lord bring the destruction, we're going to be having a good time. We're going to be partying. We're going to be drinking, laughing. You know what I'm saying? Playing, singing hymns. Why the Most High, when the Lord bring the destruction on America, and he's dropping the missiles. See, when the Lord bring the destruction, they're going to be dropping the missiles. America's going to be destroyed. We're going to get beamed up into them chariots. And then when we get beamed up in them chariots, we gonna look down and everything's gonna look like a lake of fire to us. You know what I'm saying? And while we looking at that lake of fire and at the destruction, we gonna laugh and we gonna celebrate. And we gonna drink and we gonna sing hymns. Well, we gotta get down to Revelation. We're talking about we gonna sing the song of Moses. You know that Revelation? Yeah, Let me get my Bible. We gonna sing the song of Moses. When the Lord destroy y'all, you goddamn heathens and you two thirds, we gonna celebrate, man. We gonna drink, man. Um, let me read this real quick. Uh, this is a uh, First Thessalonians uh, four, and I'm gonna start at uh, fifteen. For this we say unto you by the word of the Lord, that we which are alive and remain unto the coming of the Lord shall not prevent them which are asleep. For the Lord Himself shall descend. <laughs> from heaven for the Lord himself shall descend from heaven with a shout with the voice of the archangels and with the trump of the most high and the dead in Christ shall rise first then we which are alive and remain shall be caught up together with them in the clouds uh, in the clouds that's what I just talked about that's those chariots and when the Lord come back he bring that destruction. He, he gonna he gonna beat us up in the chariots. And everybody else gonna be destroyed. To meet the Lord in the air. To meet the Lord in the air. What's that talking about? We gonna we gonna get beamed up, just like Scotty on Star Trek. Just like they was beaming Captain Kirk up and Spock up. We gonna get beamed up. I bet you those pyramids ain't got that technology. Man, them pyramids is raggedy as hell, bro. <laughs> they done fell the fuck apart. You know what I'm saying? Pyramids they, are targets. The pyramids like ain't big targets. a bunch of pile of rocks. And so shall we ever be with the Lord. And then, yeah, that's a, talking about the kingdom of heaven. And then, yeah, you ain't gonna see no goddamn adultery after that, bro. Ain't gonna be no more adultery. Ain't gonna be no more baby mama drama. Bitches, no more child support. You know what I'm saying? Ain't gonna be none of this shit. None of this faggot shit that we got going on there. None of it. None of it. Oh, they say that uh, that's it. Uh, in the December, that there ain't going to be no uh, unemployment. And, uh, they're, they're cutting the benefits. Yeah, the unemployment. Benefits. That. That's good. That's what the talk is. They're cutting it. They need to cut all that shit. They're talking about like two million motherfuckers? Yeah, unemployment is back. Yeah, I'm next, sure it's more than that. But. Next, hopefully, SSI. Yep. It needs all just go one swoop. One hit. Yep. He's on the press and they trying to do it one by one. Yeah, he, he saw him start speeding it up though. Which he is. He started to speed it up a little. Because he know he got a short time like the scripture says in Revelation. You know. The devil know if he have but a short time. So he knows he's gonna have to start speeding it up anyway. Shit. Most high ain't on his schedule. He on the most high schedule. Yeah, right. You know? Yeah, all this shit gonna be destroyed, man. Shit. Not one second past that time that the most high got set. Not one second go past. This devil goes down. You know? You just getting that one in Revelation, the scripture of Revelation is on the 
Oh yeah. I bet you these niggas ain't out teaching the day in this cold weather so they can hang up or, or fucking uh, uh, Nate Snake, crooked ass, next year nigga. And you know this motherfucking clown here in Columbus, uh, Peraza, you know it. Peraza and the gang ain't coming out. They won't even come out when it's hot out. <laughs> yeah, yeah. There's no telling what them niggas be doing, man. They living good, though. Peraza yeah, and the gang right. living good, though. Right, still. At the crib, laying up here, Thanksgiving at Douglas. Man, that was a long yeah. ass time ago. What's that? Thanksgiving. <laughs> Thanksgiving? That was like last week. Yeah, man, there's some raggedy motherfuckers out here, man. They all celebrate Thanksgiving, Christmas. They got no truth up in them, man. I hate I hate these motherfuckers, man. Who else is a non scripture happening What was that scripture where they said they was singing the song of Moses? I'm slipping over here. Um, I know that's a revelation. Man, I can just read the song of Moses itself. Hey, get uh, Deuteronomy 32, bro. Just read that. Yeah, we gonna read the song of Moses. Nah, 32. Ain't that, ain't that right? I think that's right. Deuteronomy 32. Yeah, read that. This Deuteronomy 32 and 1. Now you, yeah, you ain't gonna, hold up. You, now you ain't gonna find this in no Egyptian book of the dead or no hieroglyphs or no Sumerian tablets. You ain't gonna find no beautiful scriptures like this in none of that shit, man. The, the, the Bible is, the Bible is the supreme book on the face of the earth. So go ahead, read that. Deuteronomy 32 and 1. Give ear, O ye heavens, and I will speak. Hold on, hold on, read that again, man. That fucking punk ass, goddamn raggedy ass coat of Hold up, man. Yeah, that shit needs a story. Read that again. Deuteronomy 32 and 1. Give ear, O ye heavens, and I will speak. And hear, O earth, the words of my mouth. My doctrine shall drop as the rain. My speech shall distill as the dew. It's raining out here right now. You know what I'm saying? That's the spirit. Go ahead. As the small rain upon the tender earth and as the showers upon the grass. Oh yeah, get the showers on the grass, yo. Get the showers on the grass. It's the showers on the grass. You know what I'm saying? Go ahead. Because I will publish the name of the Lord Ascribe ye greatness unto our God. So how do you how do you publish the name of the Lord? Publish, go back to the word public. You gotta be out in the public. We out in the public right now, and we publishing the word. That's how you be out in the streets. Shove it down your throat. Yeah, exactly. The power, you gotta shove that shit down our we we are gonna shove it down your throat. We're gonna get in your face and we're gonna force it on you. Go ahead. He is the rock. His work is perfect. His work is perfect. The work of the Most High is perfect. Okay. Keep going. For all his ways or judgment, a God of truth and without inequity, just and right is he. They have corrupted themselves. The spot is not the spot of his children. They are a perverse and crooked generation. Yeah, yo, yo, you people, you are. Uh, a crooked and perverse generation. Y'all perverted. I mean, y'all, y'all, y'all way gone astray. Y'all some goddamn heathens, man. Hey, read that part again, man. Y'all, what did that say? You a crooked and perverse generation. Read that again, bro. Oh, I got a story. Dude, me 32 and 5. Yeah, you people out here, you and motherfuckers ain't right, man. They have corrupted, corrupted themselves. You, yo, you corrupted yourself. Y'all some wicked motherfuckers. You going? Their spot is not the spot of his children. Yeah, you ain't the children of the Most High. Y'all the children of the devil. That's right. You a bunch of goddamn devils, a bunch of demons, a bunch of goddamn heathens. What's that, John 8:44? Yeah, you just, you have your father the devil. That's so you got America's the kingdom of Satan. If it's the kingdom of Satan, you got a bunch of little demons running around. Go ahead. Ghouls and goblins. Ghouls and goblins. Trolls. 
Read that one more time, man, please. Deuteronomy 32 and 5. They have corrupted themselves. Their spot is not the spot of his children. So America is the most corrupt nation on the planet Earth. It, it's, it's just a, it's a, look at these bitches, man. The worst example of people here in America. If you can call them people, they savage. They, they're not people, they savages. They're a bunch of wild animals. They're a bunch of goddamn wild hyenas, man. They came calling people. Right. This is the worst example of any motherfucker you can, you can imagine, man. And they got the nerve to mention other motherfucking places overseas and shit. Well, all, all these other nations and all these other countries, the they, black. they laugh at America. Right. They, they, they know I'm stupid. Because y'all are the dumbest right. people on the planet, Dumb man. Dumb as fuck. fucking retarded, man. Bunch of dumb, stupid fucking Dumb jackass. Fuck. Don't know shit about nothing. Dumb as fuck. They you don't can't know. stress that enough. They don't know a goddamn thing. Man. They don't know shit. Dumb and these schools don't teach them shit either. These schools, all these schools is doing is just taking your money, man. They just robbing you. It's just a goddamn business like everything else. America's a business. They're poor goddamn corporations. Mm -hmm. so everything in America is all about money. And the Bible says, for the love of money is the root of all evil. America is a capitalist nation, so everything is about money. Go ahead. They have corrupted themselves. Their spot is not the spot of his children. They are a perverse and crooked generation. Y'all perverse and y'all crooked as hell. Keep going. Do ye thus requit the Lord, O oh foolish people? Y'all bunch of goddamn foolish people. And the Lord's the gonna and the Lord's gonna destroy you. Keep going. O oh, foolish people and unwise. Y'all unwise. If you ain't found the ways of the most high, you are unwise. You a fool. Idiot. And God, yeah, it, you're retarded. Dumb and dumb. Yeah, dumb and dumb. Goddamn sling blade and busting his nut and all these bitches. <laughs> sling blade. And had, and, had a, and had a bunch of children. A bunch of sling blades out here. Right, right. They are, they're retarded like that, though. Right. Look how retarded these people are. You just look into the eyes of these people, they just retarded. I'd rather really socialize with sling blades than these foul yeah. ass people. You're right, I would uh, talk to a, yeah, a Rayman. A Rayman, yeah, Rayman got more sense than y'all, man. <laughs> dumb ass people, stupid ass people. That's why you just sometimes you just want to punch people, man. You just want to beat the shit out of people. You do, man. But you got to pray the most high to make you stop and not th think like that. You know what I'm saying? Fuck these people. Yeah, fuck these people, man. Is not he thy father that has bought thee? Has he not made thee and established thee? Remember the days of old, consider the years of many generations. Well, yeah, 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 so, yeah. They always talk about forget the past. Yeah, but, yeah. Man, you forgetting those goddamn past? Is that why they still are uh, over there in Afghanistan and Iraq and shit? Oh, they ain't never come. Well, they over to Afghanistan getting them good drugs. They getting paid, huh? Yeah, they getting paid. I mean, all wars about getting paid. Is that why they still do the reparations from Germany? Because they said forget the past. Yeah, yeah. Fake ass Jews. All them Jews, they talking about for. Yeah, yeah. If you gotta that's forget the past, good. how can they always cry about the Holocaust? Yeah. Oh, I thought we got. That's old news. That's like a guy almost a hundred years ago now. That's old make believe news, right? Yeah, old make believe news. <laughs> the Holocaust never happened. Okay. They still talk about the Holocaust. Yeah, motherfuckers don't even remember Michael Jordan, but they remember the Holocaust. They start. Yeah, right. If you mention the Holocaust, people will start crying. They go, ah! They start crying shit. And that shit they never fucking. The diary of Anne Frank. That shit was made up too. That shit never happened. Everything dealing with our history, we gotta forget. Mm -hmm. The real hunter, of course. Yeah, they don't want to talk about the slaughter of the North American Indians. They don't want to talk about that. You know what I'm saying? You know, it, oh, that's a long time ago. We can't talk about that. Real Holocaust. Yeah, that's a real Holocaust for your ass. Mm -hmm. Trail of tears. Trail of tears. They said they killed like 120 million North American Indians. And they crying about a, a, a couple of Jew motherfuckers, man. You know what I'm saying? Just a couple. 
<laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you got more than that. Psalm 32 and 7. Remember the days of old, consider the years of many generations. Ask thy father, and he will show thee thy elders, and they will tell thee. So you gotta ask the elders, and they'll tell thee. But you, you, your boy Polite, he ain't trying to go to the elders. He thinks he an elder. He an elder of confusion. You know what I'm saying? He an elder of confusion. Cause it, I mean, the Lord only set up a, a, a certain people to be the elders. You ain't got a whole bunch of elders. Hey, read that again, man. Psalms 32 and 7. Remember the days of old. Consider the years of, of many generations. Ask thy father, and he will show thee thy elders, and they will tell thee. The elders will tell thee. They'll teach you. They show you the right way. Because you just, the Lord, you got to have teachers that understand the truth. And you can't be a proud motherfucker. Because a proud motherfucker can't have nobody teach him. He already know everything. You know what I'm saying? Can't teach you like that. Keep going. Psalms 32 and 8. When the Most High divided to the nations their inheritance, when he separated the oh. sons of Adam. When he separated the sons of Adam, he separated. So he didn't break. The Lord didn't come to bring everybody together. He separated the sons of Adam. Keep going. He set the bowels of the people according to the number of the children of Israel. The number of children of Israel. Keep going. For the Lord's portion is his people. Jacob is the lot of his inheritance. So Israel is the Lord's inheritance. Okay, because Israel is the chosen people. You know what I'm saying? There's only one chosen people. That's the nation of Israel. That's it. The Lord, the Lord ain't choose no goddamn Hamites. Ham is not the lot. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, I got another good point to two. It's like, uh, remember that your boy is Saren Suit and Seti? He tried to say that the Ham, Ham means burnt. You know, it means the same thing as Kemet, and Kemet means burnt. You know what I'm saying? So he, he said that's proof that black people are Hamites. <laughs> well, for, uh, hold up. But Shem was Ham's brother, right? Am I correct? Right. If Shem was Ham's brother, what color was Shem if Ham was black? If that was his brother. If Ham had a brother and he was black, what color would his brother be? I mean, these people don't even think before they speak, man. You know what I'm saying? They, they don't really think that shit out. If, Shem, if Ham was black and you know he was black, what color was his brother? It came out the same womb as him. And the Bible didn't say otherwise, did it? Because when Esau was born, the Lord made a distinction. Right. And he let you know that he looked different. Yeah. Esau looked different. They let you know that he was different. Yeah. The sons of Noah, they didn't mention nothing like that. It, wasn't not, it was no big deal. Because yeah. they was all dark skinned. Hey, no, speaking of Noah, you yeah, see no that movie coming out? Oh, uh, with Russell Crowe? That's going to be some bad shit. I, I think Russell Crowe might be an Israelite. That's going, yeah, he's definitely an Israelite. Yeah, because I... Yeah, you ever see that movie with him and Denzel Washington? The, he, the Lord showed him a chariot. He got a chariot yeah, on yeah, camera. Yeah, yeah, You showed me the video. Yep. You, I think you, yeah, you sent me that video. Yeah. You can tell in that movie he played. That video, too. Gladiator. No. That's the best one, boy. Yeah, I never seen that. The one with Denzel Washington. Old movie came on. mid ninety. Younger, it was called virtual, virtual yeah. velocity. Right, 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 right. right, right. Yeah, yeah. You can tell. Yeah, he was young. He was, yeah. he was silly he was as hell. He was too. I don't know. <laughs> I don't think I've hell. seen that one. Yeah, yeah. him and Dan's little watch. I didn't. It? Oh, you know, that's an old one. I don't know. Yeah, he uh, he pretty much was some type of uh, oh. artificial intelligence. No, I think I do remember that. And he wound up coming yeah. out. Russell was like Crowe was in that? Yeah, that was, he was the bad, he was like Sam. Oh, shit. That's, see, I, I didn't realize that was him. That's before, young as hell. That, that's before he blew up. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah, shit. That's gonna be a bad movie. Yeah, that's gonna yeah, be a yeah. badass fucking movie, man. Yeah, that's no. And yeah, you see the previews, they just had the what? Now, the water was shooting out the earth. Who was it? Russell Crowe. Now, hold up. How can uh, they make no movie about the Egyptian uh, tale? Right, right, right. Because right. that's their spirit, because everybody's into the Bible now. That's everybody right. getting into the Bible. No, don't we want, everybody want to hear about the Bible. Nobody want to hear about the Egyptology bullshit. That's why the Bible series on the History Channel was yeah, so now, popular. Yeah, yeah. That yep. shit was a like number one show. That's right. I bet them niggas come over here to that movie with the mummy. Oh, that mummy, that shit's retarded. Yeah, yeah. retarded. I bet they love that movie. What's that big faggot, Brandon Fraser? Yeah. That big faggot. <laughs> hey. Oh, I don't mean I'm like something new. You know, I never watched that dumb show. I never felt. 
the neat I, I never even was attracted to watching that dumb shit. I watched the old shit they made back in the 30s and 40s though. There's some Avenue Costello. You know, some old school shit. Bro. Right, Avenue Costello in the money. That's my shit right here, boy. You got more than two doing this. Deuteronomy 32 and 9. For the Lord's portion is his people. It's his people. Who's the Lord's people? Keep going. Deuteronomy 32 and 9. For the Lord's portion is his people. Who's the Lord's people? Hey, we you, are. You, uh, you don't know nothing. Don't know <laughs> you, you don't know nothing. Huh? Who is his people? Oh, I'm trying to tell you. That's why. I'm... Well, tell me. I'm mean, having to come back <laughs> now. Come on. Hold on. We're well, going to tell you right here. Read the all scripture. Right, all right, all right. Let the scripture tell you. Deuteronomy 32 and 9. For the Lord's portion is his people. It's his people. Keep going. Jacob is the lot of his inheritance. Jacob. Who's Jacob? Keep going. Son of uh, let's see, Isaac, Abraham, Jacob. Yeah. Jacob's name was changed to Israel. Uh huh. And the Lord's people is Israel. Yeah. So do you believe in the one they, they call Jesus Christ? Uh huh. Okay, who did he come to save? He came to save us, the entire world. No, 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 no. He got to be specific. He got to be specific. Yeah, he got to be specific when he got to be put in. Yeah, man. He just said, yeah, said the Lord's inheritance is Jacob. Uh huh. Who was Jacob? Jacob was Israel. It was Israel. Okay, who, were the, who was Israel today? We are Israel. Right. I mean, we are the people. Those I mean, us. Those who serve uh, the Father in heaven. Yes, come on here. But uh -huh. only an Israelite will serve the Father, though. Yes, yes, yes. And yes. heathen ain't going to follow after the most high. Okay, so I guess I can't say that all of us. Yeah, watch, watch this. Yeah, there you go. Well, all right. Those who, yeah, no, what is it, man? Well, so too heathen much. is too busy uh, following uh, uh, the Lord. Who's all those who serve our Father in heaven be known as our brother, sister, brother, and so on? Well, watch this, Matthew 15. Right, come on, come on. Matthew 15, 24. Now, this yeah. is red letters right here. Uh -huh. You know yeah, what that yeah, means, yeah. right? Well, they say that's the words that Jesus said, but uh, we don't know how. No, there. we know that. Well, go ahead and read that. There. That's what they say, though. Matthew 15, 24. Yeah. But he answered and said, I am not sent but unto the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Mm -hmm. He said, I am not beauty. sent but unto the lost sheep of mm -hmm. the house of Israel. Yes, yes, yes. So, how, how come how come ain't none of these churches teaching that? If this is what the Bible says, and the Lord said he came to Israel. I can't say what's being taught in other churches. There ain't nobody teaching that no. except for us. Okay. No, no, I can't say that now. I can't say that. I mean, you got your four men right here. I mean, how many I people here are in this world? I, I've been to plenty of churches, man, and I ain't never heard no Israel. The Negroes is, is the tribe of Judah. You don't hear that in these churches. You go to the black uh, church and they tell no, you. No, 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 I can't church. say that. Well, they tell you you a goddamn I'll tell you what, I'll give you a hundred dollars, you take me to a church that's doing that. No. I'm, I'm telling you, you. No, I'm with you. 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 Did they tell you you a goddamn Canaanite? Yeah, right. <laughs> they, they tell you that. Cain is cursed. Uh -huh. yeah, Cain is cursed. <laughs> they tell you your ass is cursed. Are you cursed? And mm -hmm. you ain't no Israelite. Canaan. You just need to go on with that Israelite I shit. I don't mean to be funny here. I appreciate what you brothers are doing out here. But I am, I'm on my way to a date and I'm supposed to stop that program. A date? We're on a date right now, too. Yeah, we, we about to get married, bro. Uh -huh. We married. We the, bri we, we the bride. Oh, bro, you know who the bride is? Who's the bride? We are. Who? Who we? The people, Israel. No, they, 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 you got me more specific Israel, than that. Yeah, Israel, Israel's the bride. Let's uh -huh. just say the elect. Okay. <laughs> the most high is the husband. Yes. Okay. That's God. That's the most high. Uh -huh. Okay. Yes. You on a date? You on the way to a date? I'm on my way to a date. Um, Hopefully it's a white girl. No, 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 it's not. No. <laughs> well, hey, y'all enjoy y'all's evening right, here bro. and be blessed what you're doing. They don't want to take nothing serious. Yeah. Uh huh. Goddamn stand up. Go ahead, bring it up quick. Let's get some more of these fools out here. Look at it. It looks like a grown up Oota Luta. <laughs> Oota, yeah. It looks like one that grew up and shit, bro. Look at that. These people just look retarded to me, man. I just look at the average person. They just look dumb as hell to me. They just. Can you, the most high I show you through the spirit how stupid people are, man. Oh, uh, wait. What you got? These people are retarded, man. I hate motherfuckers. Let me get this one. Uh, uh, Isaiah 64 and 1. Oh, that thou wouldest rend the heavens, that thou wouldest come down 
that the mountains might flow down at thy presence. As when the melting fire burneth, the fire causes the waters to boil. Oh yeah, the fire causes the water to boil. Man, that's, that's amazing, eh? Man, what kind of fire is that? What kind of fire makes water boil? Keep going. To make thy name known to thy adversaries. And the Lord gonna make his name known. Y'all, <laughs> y'all want everybody want to come against the most high and say, oh, the most high ain't shit. Y'all don't. Y'all, everything y'all talking about some bullshit. Y'all out there on the corner, y'all looking stupid as hell. You know what I'm saying? Y'all raggedy motherfuckers out there looking dumb as hell. You raggedy motherfuckers. Yeah, it's just, everybody talk shit. You know what I'm saying? They don't realize they come up against us. They're not come up against us. They come up against the most. Oh, no, I got a scripture for that. You know, dumbass motherfuckers was given to them for their salvation. They buck up and just gets it and treat it as if it's trash. You know, totally throw it away like it's trash, man. So when that time comes, most I gonna throw them away. He gonna treat them that same fucking way. To, to make that name known to thine adversaries, that the nations may tremble at thy presence. Yeah, all, all you, all, all these nations are gonna tremble, man. Y'all gonna be afraid. When oh. the day, was that shit dead? That shit going? Yeah. Okay. So the most high, when, when the day of the Lord comes, y'all gonna you're gonna be afraid. Like the scripture say, Amos, it say the day of the Lord is uh darkness and not light. Ooh. It ain't gonna be no light, it's gonna be it's gonna be <laughs> terrible. It's gonna be some dark, dark shit. It's gonna be scary, it's gonna be like this. It's gonna be terrible. You go like that last uh, blackout we had, man. Our street was so fucking dark. I didn't see a motherfucker until he was like four or five feet away from it's me, man. It's gonna be worse than that. It was, yeah, it's gonna be some yeah. dark shit. You're gonna be scary, man. It's gonna be, you know, it's gonna be the evil days. Yeah. The evil days is coming. It's gonna be evil out here. Right. When you know, thou didst terrible things which we look not for. So the Lord gonna do some terrible things. It's gonna be fucking terrible for your ass, man. Keep going. Thou camest down, the mountains flowed down at thy presence. For since the beginning of the world, men have not heard nor perceived by the ear, neither hath the eye seen. O oh God, beside thee, what he hath prepared for him that waiteth for him. Had no understanding. No. Even if you tell these motherfuckers, they don't understand shit. They, no understand. they ain't even trying to understand nothing. Right, the Bible says, he that have an ear, let him hear. And y'all ain't got no ears. Right. And so the Lord only dealing with a few people. Like, I, I used to get all messed up when people didn't want to listen to us. I don't give a fuck now. You know what I'm saying? I know the Lord, he gonna raise up who he gonna raise up. We matured a little bit. I, I don't give a fuck if we put up a hundred videos and only one person wakes up. That's all that matters. That's all that matters. You get that one person. The scriptures say that angels rejoice when just one sinner repents. When just one person wake up, the angels throw a party. And that one, they rejoice because that one is an elect. Exactly. First fruit. And that oh, one, that one, that, that's a mighty person. That's a, yeah. that's a big deal. Just one person waking up is a big deal. Uh -huh. He, you know what I'm saying? Because we spent, that's why it's called the elect. The elect is special. You know what I'm saying? So 65 and 2. That was done on Psalm 65 and 2. I have spread out my hands all the day unto a rebellious people which walketh in the way that was not good. And, and the way these people live is not good. Okay, look at the way these people live. They live like goddamn heathens. You got a bunch of adulterous ass women. Like we say, a woman, she always, a woman to commit adultery with a hundred men and get child support from each and every one of them. You know what I mean? A woman never stays with her husband. There's no family. Little kids is being raised by the woman. The man has no rights. Woman has all the rights. This place is all backwards, bro. Now you got faggots get married. Child support love seeing them bitches coming back down there. Oh, yeah. you oh, how you doing, girl? You back? You see that oh, shit? You got another yeah, one? Yeah. You got another one? Can't pay it off though. Yeah. yeah. You yeah. got another nigga, huh? Good yeah. girl. Good nigga. Hey, read that again, man. 
Psalm 65, Isaiah 65 and 2. I have spread out my hands all the day unto a rebellious people. These are rebellious people, man. And none of these people fall away. They don't even keep the Ten Commandments. Like even the most basic, they can't keep the Ten Commandments. Like the Ten Commandments said, don't commit adultery. But in America, adultery is, a, you know what I'm saying? That's a encouraged. Like all these, all these women, it's like popular now to have sex with a bunch of different men. Like all these college girls, they go to a different party each week. Like we say, uh, every day. Well, 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 I'm just being conservative. Like they got a, a, a after, like every week there's a college football game. There's a party after each game, and so these bitches they they they, they fucking they, they fucking all kind of dudes at all these parties, bro. You know what I'm saying? And then they upload the videos on the internet. You use the dietary law for an example. And there's many things that you ain't supposed to eat. They can't stop eating one thing on that list. They just eat everything. That's why y'all, you got all these fat ass hoes, man. All these women all fat. That's because they all eat pork, they eat bacon. They eat shrimp, you know what I'm saying? They eat ham sandwiches, lobster. They eat goddamn catfish. Eating pussy. Yeah, bitch, oh yeah, bitches. <laughs> Bitches don't even want to fuck with dudes no more. They just want to eat pussy. Yeah. Right. They just want to look at other bitches' assholes. <laughs> get some disease make their mouth a little piece. Which walketh in a way that was not good after their own thoughts. Yeah, these people walk after their own thoughts. That's why every time like a, you got a woman come up to us, 